Meanwhile, back here in Arizona, a similar site at our state capitol with fences up and security officials on high alert. Teen 12's Jen Wall joins us live this morning from the state capitol. So, Jen, what are you seeing out there? Yeah, good morning to you guys. So just hours away here from President elect Joe Biden being elected or being sworn in rather as our nation's next president. And this is a day state capitals across the U.S. have been preparing for when it comes to security, just like ours right here in Phoenix. Now, although protests here locally have been quiet so far, we did see that violence earlier this month back at the U.S. Capitol. And here at home in Phoenix, you can see there is security very tight surrounding our state capitol. You have the fences up that have been here all week long. You cannot cross the street from here to where we are to the capitol and these fences surround the entire building. We've also seen DPS vehicles driving on throughout the week, just protecting the area all because of those attempts to storm the U.S. Capitol by President Trump supporters earlier this month. They've been prompting the warnings from the FBI saying armed protests are being planned in all 50 states leading up to today. But again, the Arizona State Capitol remaining quiet so far. Just had a small group of Trump supporters showing up over the weekend. And of course, that was all very calm. The governor's office as well telling us that they've ramped up security through today and will be ready for anything if it does happen. But again, guys, we are expecting things to stay calm as it is right now. For now, we're live in Phoenix. Jen Wall, Today in AZ.